family and friends and fellow YouTubers. It's Kim here from Hancock Home Center and Gardens. And today is Monday, August the 21st. It is time for Motivational Monday. Now what I have been doing is reading a statement out of the book 52 List for Happiness. However, I think what I'm going to do today is just share with you the excitement that everyone is having over the historic uh, eclipse of the sun and uh, my brother made a statement on Facebook uh, that I just want to share my brother is a Baptist minister and uh, and we all share in the faith of God that everyone in my family believes in God and I just thought what he said was so powerful he said the best thing about the eclipse is God brought us all together today, and it was by His power. And I think that is just so true because everyone has stopped for a few minutes today to witness this eclipse of the sun. And uh, so I know some places uh, got to view it better than others, but I know everyone is aware of this historical moment uh, day. And yes, we all stopped and we all uh, took interest in the power of the movement of the moon and the sun. And, um, and for those of us who believe in God and, and feel like it is His work, um, stop for a few minutes and, and thank God for, you know, for this power that He has. And um, so anyway, um, yeah, so I was um, very excited today as well as uh, my daughter was and, and John was excited about it. So I'm going to show you um, some clips that we took today of uh, what was happening here on our homestead while the eclipse was going on. Now, um, we did not attempt to take a picture. Uh, you have to have a special filter for a picture for a camera. But uh, we did view it through special glasses. So um, Karen uh, described it well for us. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and show you those clips, and I hope you enjoy them. Um, we also can salsa today, so be sure and look for a salsa video. This time it was pear salsa. Okay, what's happening, guys? Because I can't look at it. Well, it's really cool. Okay. History is happening. That's what's up. Well, describe it to me. Um, the sun looks like a crescent because the moon is going in front of it. How far in front is it now? Uh, half, three fourths. No, it's not halfway there yet. It's not halfway there yet. No. Okay. Yeah, it's almost. It's just so cool. <laughs> I was afraid it was supposed to be cloudy today. Uh huh. So I didn't know if we would get to see it, and we do. <laughs> Did you see the last one when you were in elementary school? We had one. Maybe it wasn't a full one. Well, no, I don't remember one in elementary. Hmm. But I was thinking there was one in the seventies or eighties. That's what I thought too. Yeah. Because I was going to town on those getting gone. Huh. But I don't know what was a full eclipse. And I was thinking it was in the seventies or the eighties. Oh yeah. I wonder how dark it'll actually get. I know, I'm curious too. Yeah, you're right. It's, it's, it's not quite half, but it does look like a crescent. It, instead of a crescent moon, we have a crescent sun. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah. It'll be, it'll be exciting to see... Um, oh, I can't see you. It'll be <laughs> exciting to see um, how dark it gets. Yeah. Although it's pretty cloudy today anyway. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. It looks like... I don't know, like the tip of your fingernail. Oh. <laughs> So 
Wow. Just so you guys know, I am videotaping from the inside of the um, laundry room. <laughs> I'm not out there. And I'm not looking, so. Yeah, I don't know where your friends are washing from, but I know that Columbia area has a really good view. Uh-huh. Columbia, Missouri. Yep. Yeah, I wonder if Katie's out looking at it. It is getting much darker. Yes, it is. This is just so cool. Do you want to look? Yep. Okay. Oh my goodness, you can't hardly really see it at no. all. The sun's almost gone. Just like you said, just fingertip. Huh. That's pretty cool. I mean, this is like, this is August 21st, 2017. It doesn't happen very often. I don't know. I need to look it up. Okay, so it is one, well, what is it, about 112? Yes. And total eclipse takes place at 115, right? Yes, yes. Yeah. Dark. It is getting dark. It feels like it's about nine o'clock at night. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is so cool. Alright, let's see just coming. Gonna make it just in time. Where'd it go? Oh there it is. Dude, I can't move. I can almost not see it. Well, that's why it's called an eclipse daughter. <laughs> Karen's sister-in-law, Lexi Kendrick, has joined in the viewing of the eclipse. It's amazing how dark it's getting out here. Is the sun gone, guys? I don't see it. It's gone. Yeah, it's got clouds over it, too. I saw the last little bit. I guess they just didn't want you looking at it while the sun was shining. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's gone now. You can't hardly tell where the sun's at. Yeah, you can't. Is that gone? I don't know where the clouds So are. can I shoot up that way then? Yeah, there's, yeah, there's nothing, nothing up there. there. Is that supposed to drop up to the The sun was right at yeah. the top of that tree. How long does this cover last? And there's nothing there anymore. It slowly starts to come down. Like the pole left for two years. Yeah. Yeah, it takes three minutes total for the total eclipse, and then it'll start to come back slowly. Cool. All right. Wave at the camera. Say, we were here on this historic day. <laughs> we were here on this historic day. <laughs> now I'm just looking at the clouds. 